China develops handheld crowd control sonic gun which causes eyes and internal organs to painfully vibrate, causing dizziness and vomiting. Here's a summary of the article. China has developed the world's first handheld sonic gun which can disperse crowds by causing painful vibrations in the eyeballs, eardrums and internal organs. The rifle, which was developed by law enforcement and the military, uses low frequency sounds, causing a biological effect on the body. According to the South China Morning Post, studies have shown deeper noises, or infrasounds, can cause anything from mild discomfort to dizziness, vomiting, bowel spasms, organ damage, and heart attacks, the publication reports. The sonic weapon, which are typically mounted on vehicles, is handheld and powered by gas, which, when heated, will emit a deep and monotonous sound, the Chinese Academy of Sciences said. It is not known when the weapon will be used by Chinese soldiers or law enforcement or if they will be used on anti-government protests in Hong Kong. It comes after police have used non-lethal weapons to tackle protesters in the in the autonomous region of China after weeks of political unrest. Riot police have used tear gas and rubber bullets to disperse demonstrations as violence escalated on the streets. Hong Kong has been rocked by a series of anti-government protests for the past 3 months. The demonstrations were initially sparked by a proposed law that would allow some criminal suspects to be sent to the mainland China to stand trial. This post received a score of 33,182, with an upvote ratio of 94%. Here are the top comments in response to this article. Didn't the U.S. military have this 20 years ago? They mounted the guns on Humvees and can disperse crowds of people instantly. Kindly feels like your skin is melting haha. The U.S. version used EMI, this uses sound. Similar end results though, except the U.S. version also makes you feel like you're on fire. The U.S. has developed and utilized sound-based ones as well. Was expecting that to be a YouTube link of Justin Bieber. Upvote but Canadian. Upvote. No, that's Scottish. Upvote. Upvote, eh? Imagine this used in warfare or in Black Friday to get the best deals. Force choking a bitch to get a 98% off flat screen TV. Most of the deals are more like 33% off this TV which we marked up 50% yesterday. That and there are specific TVs made for Black Friday that don't have a majority of the bells and whistles its regular model does, so the price you're paying for is a fair price for what's actually in it but people think they're getting a deal. Well a $30 flat screen is a $30 flat screen. If you can't order groceries and program your microwave from the living room is it really a TV? It's usually like, it comes with four HDMI ports normally but we've stripped it down to one, no RCA ports, and things of that nature. Oh man, so I got Black Friday ripped off out of season? I mean, I told you it was just a brown cardboard box colored with a sharpie. I see nothing but good things for the future of protesters and public protests in general. S in case it wasn't obvious. Protests are over, my new best friend is civil war. Indeed this seems to be a passive-aggressive way of saying war has started on the population. This has been said for months. The fire rises. We didn't start the fire. It was always burning. Since the world's been turning. We didn't start the fire. I guess at business school they don't teach you all how to make a cheese pita. It's fire guy. A sonic weapon which uses deep infrasounds that cause bowel spasms. So, the infamous brown note is real. I see they purchased this tech from Taco Corp. Same concept has already been used with electromagnetic waves at a frequency just above microwaves. Low frequency sounds penetrate materials far better than high frequency sounds, meaning that things like an extra layer of clothes will help very little, as opposed to high frequency used by LRAD. You can probably largely nullify LRAD with some high-frequency earplugs, won't work here. As a result, it would probably underperform compared to a traditional assault rifle, but it firing would not be audible. I imagine it would probably be used as a covert protest quelling tool, something to be used by plain clothes police. This video was automatically created by Reddit to speech. The article and comments in this video were selected from Reddit according to their upvotes, and any paraphrasing was performed by smmry.com, without any human intervention.